we kept running out of space in our small freezer and this means that I can't have ice cubes. So I've bought a small chest freezer which fits neatly behind the shower. I purposely put in the power sockets so that the chest freezer could go here. It's only got a two star rating, but none of the freezers in the shop had anything better than two. Now I've got plenty of ice and we can go shopping less frequently. It's unusual for our batteries to dip below 90% full. With the addition of the freezer, it diminished slightly but it hasn't made a real difference. The kitchen roof gets a bit too hot. This is because it doesn't have solar panels to shade it. I've already welded on extra brackets. I'll add more solar panels to create shade and this will help with the electricity that the freezer is using. There's even space in the normal fridge freezer. Thanks for watching and I'll see you for the next instalment of the adventure. This topic is covered in full detail in part 2 of the ebook How to Build an Off-Grid Shipping Container House. For more information about the ebooks, please visit my website at buildshippingcontainerhouse.com. Press subscribe to follow more of our adventures and please press the like button if you enjoyed this video. It helps the channel.